Chris, you're looking all rather ramble there, well, mate. Yeah, the can only neck. be one AK guy on YouTube, so I thought I'd try and give him a run for his money. I mean, that looked pretty authentic, mate. That and that is, is, uh, I, know we've is had a, I know we've had it on the channel before. Yeah, we've done a um, four-part build series when it was basically looking a lot worse than this. That was a, all rusty. <laughs> and the finish on the on the because this is CO2 177 steel BBs that was all that had been like up on display in a shop and there, there was moisture in there it was all rusty and stuff but we got rid of most of it give it a nice patina three or four part video thing we yeah, done four, four parts, parts yeah. um, the the wood finish on it I don't know if they done it because that was CO2 or not but. That was terrible, so we stripped that down and then stained the wood ourselves. Um, that stain was basically what they had in the ship. Yeah. So, so and that came out well. I like it. What we're doing, deal? I'll just give you a quick run through with it, and then we're gonna shoot some yeah. targets. Don't so, um, pop the mag out, guys, and um, right. I guess that's where. Well, this is a rocking mag, so you put your thumb against that. And rock and roll mag. Yeah. And you pull that out. That's not like an an AR weed. Put it straight in, yeah. or like a all that banging, or all that banging and slamming yeah. and stuff. So you got to rock it in, but like that. So and what I'll do, I'll just put this down. And the mag for the CO2 gun is yeah. right, you're just pushing that metal pin, and there's your CO2 tank. Oh, how neat! There's your your mag. That's quite fiddly to get the balls in in the little hole. Say that again. That's quite fiddly to get the balls in the little yeah. hole. Yeah, oh, right. Yeah. That's just wind is howling, so I'm sorry, the verse, if you're getting wind yeah. noise on the audio, it's crazy. That was meant to be the start of summer, but you know, yeah. British weather. So all you do is pull it down to the side, fit as many balls in there as you can, and then set it. Steel and then, BBs, 177s. And then just push that down again, that will slide in. This is all metal frame, apart from this, this is a little bit of plastic, this is plastic. Could you gives. say, Daz, that all the guns we've got, that's the pretty much the most authentic. That does that look. look the real, I mean, yeah. that is pretty much the real deal. Well, I'll um, just show you, I'll just take yeah. the main thing down. So this, like, on a normal AK, is you, you push in here to take off your, your dust cover. It feels stripped as I'm impressed. Yeah. Yeah. So there's your dust cover. And then you just pull out your main spring. Oh. And then you This is all like the rail the rail gun, this is exactly pretty pretty, pretty much, much, yeah. Like the trigger group kinda looks the same, so I think that's why it's legendary, that's but reliable, yeah. stripped down in the well, field. And uh, the yes. price of these have gone up cool, no mate. end for when, yeah, I, when I bought they're it. They're 400 up quick mate if you yeah. get one. Right. So, yeah man, I can't slide. wait to see you shoot it. I mean, them bullets. They can go down there for So you've got a couple of rails in there. And then you just that's slide it in simple. there. Yeah. And then you get. Used to do this shit in the dark, didn't you? Yeah. Well, this is why it's such a good design. That's pretty sunny. About 10 minutes ago. As soon as you said video, someone knew. <laughs> Clouds come out, the wind howled, airplanes started flying over, all the little dogs in the neighborhood just start howling in a minute. And um, yeah. Well, it was music playing. The usual sort of shooting a video day. Yeah. Yeah. Happy. Alright, so I'll just put some uh, steel BBs in my hand, pulled the lever down. Lever. It's a lever, mate. Lever, Trust me. Lever. Trust me. This lever business. Right. All you youngsters call that a lever when that's a lever. Oh, uh, Norfolk English, mate. That's a lever. Then you've got to put that in that tiny little hole on then. Lever's what you get off a cow, mate, when you skin it. <laughs> wow. That's what lever is. I didn't claim to be no fucking... As a bear. I didn't claim to be Shakespeare. If you come to Norfolk, a bear is a bear is a bear. It was a bear. That could be fucking a furry, or it could be in a point grass. <laughs> That's the same thing, it's both the same, pronounced the same. Why would there be a bear in Norfolk, as in the grizzly? I don't know. Well, unless you'd gone back to fucking pre-medieval times. We had brown bears there, didn't we? Sabretooth bears. Sabretooth. 
So we leave cock nose. We'll go on and then my pants. <laughs> Giant sloth. No, cock <laughs> So this looked pretty tedious mate. Yeah, I've got a speed right. loader for my um, G10. That's like this thing you squeeze it and the balls roll out really quick. Yeah. I think that would be ideal for that. I was just, I don't know where it is mate. There's got to be something better. For yeah, how many to hold? I don't know, I haven't been counting. 30, 50? No, 20. 18, 20 I 18, 20? My pistol hold like 18 mate. That must hold oh, more than that. Right. Probably like 20 then. The G10 hold like 18. Let me have a look. You can see how many. You can count them. No, yeah, ain't many, is it? No, no, it's see. not. No, you can't say it. Right, so, um, so once it's loaded, you then move the lever. Thank you. There. There's yeah. some guy um, made a comment in one of our videos, Daz. He said uh, the back and forth between us made it really entertaining. Yeah. I'd tend to agree. It's just we've got to get the audio sorted on. Right, before you start shooting Daz, don't point it anywhere, I'm now going to put the range cam on. And, um, yeah, get your bullets back on, mate. Honestly, that's a Hollywood. That's, that's like 50 quid's worth of bullets somewhere. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Hang on, mate. So, Rambo. Daz posing as Rambo. You do look the part, mate, I must say. That them bullets. See how it goes. Right. Start with the cans. Cans? Yeah. Sucks a bit out. Yeah. more left and right, I would have thought that was out. Well, that's just. Yeah, that's why. Maybe you got to twist that bit on the end and fucking. Yeah. Has it got left and right on that bit? No, well, look at it. Look at the play in it. That's oh, like their yeah, AK yeah, sights, yeah, mate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you're better off doing three eyes through the end. Yeah, that's It's a shame because that's a good gun. They could have put that a decent sight on it. We were shooting this the other day and I was hitting everything with it. When I first brought it round, I gave it That's a quick, true, quick yeah, blitz, didn't yeah. I? That is pretty windy as well. But that right? is a fresh tank, so there might be yeah. like yeah. extra pressure. Plus the distance there, mate, is probably asking a lot of it for a BB-177 thing. That's hitting at ours. Yeah. I think it's out. Have we ever done a power test on that? Yeah, I think it's like one and a half foot pound or something. Yeah. Yeah. Shall I load it up and then you can have a yeah, look at it? Yeah, mate, yeah. I just want to load the bullets with the 8 gang. I feel like an African warlord. Why are you gay? Hmm? Why are you gay? Why am I gay? <laughs> that African news reader is fucking hilarious. Yeah, these sides are pretty. That's a shame, isn't it? Because they're. Yeah. Well, it's got like a slide along thing. Yeah, that's, that's you. just a little bit of shit, isn't it? Yeah. That's pretty. Can they do something about that? That one couple really. of washers put in, that, that what pin one driving out, and some little packers put in there. It's quite heavy as well, isn't Yeah, I'm here, it's looking. So, 
Nice. The uh, seal to your AK, uh, even just to stand there looking in the mirror, yeah. the bullets around your neck has got more effort. That is. But well, what else do you need? No brainer. Exactly. If I had Instagram, mate, this, this would be me. So as always, thanks for tuning in, like, comment, subscribe and uh, we'll be back with you again soon.